Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven. And we got Manny back again, twice in one week. Are you hyped to play some Axman, Manny? Only if the coin allows it. Maybe. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yes. Exactly. Poor Harold, he's such a bad card and he relies solely on being able to place the Axman where we need to or the weather or whatever. And Unfortunately, if uh, if you do lose the coin flip, you're in a bad shit. We, uh, we put the veterans in to try and... If that does happen, we got something to play turn one, but um, it's it's a mix of the veterans with uh, with some harpooners to throw them into the weather, and then we got some uh, hey man, nice shot battle maidens to <laughs> try and bring back some some of whatever we need. Uh, we do got one lacerate in here. If we do run into like beer uh, scoyatel, we're in kind of useless card but if we do run into something like uh neckers we might be able to stack them up and hit them pretty good that's but, for sure uh, all right it's it, but it's pretty much standard issue i mean you're just trying to get some weather on the board beef up your axeman and uh hopefully you can tough one out it's 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 rough with harold but we're gonna do our best so. Devil, don't sound so depressed man <laughs> we got this <laughs> <laughs> all right we got this with our powers combined. Oh, we're going to need more than that. Yeah. All right. I'm going to tell you something, though. Your deck naming skills are a spot on the... Yeah, dude. Right. If, yeah. If, if they have or have a Gwent, uh, like, slam for for deck names, I'm, I'm, I'm going to gonna get an invite, I think. Nice, nice. <laughs> those crown points, dude. Get those yeah. crown points. So we got rat of it. That's uh, that's kind of rough. Yes, we're gonna need a a the thing that unlocks our things. Uh, donor. Yep. We have white frost. So that's okay. We got one of the axe man. Um, one harpooner. We could drop the Freya right. And decoy can unlock an axe man. True, but I'm not sure if we drop a Freya though. What do you think we drop? A veteran? I veteran. think a veteran would be better because uh, if if anything goes wrong or if it goes too long, yeah, I think it was like that. Because if anything was uh, was gonna go wrong, we can use the Freya to counteract that. Keep this. Keep the rest. Yeah, I think we'll keep it there. Hey. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> of course. All right. So we'll play the. Is there anything of theirs that's row locked? Anything of theirs that is row locked? Yes, their range. Their lock, uh, their lock on range. All right, well, let's put this guy here then. And the other lock is the the weather girls on siege, right? Yeah. Armor. That's going to suck. Oh, no. Do we start our herald now? I think we start our, our Axeman there. Alright. Because uh, this, is, this way, if he if he locks it, I mean, you know, Godspeed, you know? We could decoy it back. Yeah. He's thinking about it. Then we can, har we can Harpoon or whatever he plays away from there, right? Yep. Let me Ooh, see. Lightning doesn't do it, though. No, I think it's gonna be a beer. No. Oh, it's like okay, okay. So we move her back because she doesn't have armor, right? And that puts us still positive, right? Yeah. By one. <sighs> dude, dude, it's 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 you know we got this devil, we got it, easy peasy lemon squeezy, dude. Ooh. Ah! It's gotta live. It lives. Survive! Yes. What do we What do we pick up now, though? I think we got a herald, dude. And that's the only thing that puts us ahead, right? Right. Look at that. Oh, he ignores armor. That's right. <laughs> 
You did you know, something right, way, Harold. In, in a way that I don't know, dude. I think that that's gonna come to bite us. Dude. He's gonna take the the better away. Ooh, dude, the really. early Dijkstra. He's gonna go with the negative. Positive. Okay, that's not a very good Zoltan there. Ooh, Jesus, oh, Jesus. Oh God. How do we pass this now? I don't think we can. I mean, we can't. We can move back the ten with another harpooner. That's two damage. Uh, yeah, I think I think that was the most reasonable way. I'm not so sure how far we're gonna take this out. All right, let's go. Yeah, we're still two down. Uh, hopefully he never doesn't notice it. He didn't notice. Oof. He keeps going. Do we... I think it's time to drop the weather, dude. Like... Frost? Yeah. Because he didn't notice the first time, right? Right. Okay. If he notices now, I'm gonna be salty. <laughs> but uh, you know, whether this is a big like get out kind of thing, uh, we're gonna have to go two down, dude. Yeah. And then after this, what are we gonna do? Uh, we will have to open pass. Hopefully, he uses Radovid, and then we can decoy our guy back. Although he doesn't get any points because this one's still got one armor on it or two armor. There you go. You need that round one, man. Get it. Get it. Yeah. <laughs> the greed is real, dude. He doesn't hey. know. He doesn't know. Okay. Okay. Do we pass now, though? God, that is so much strength. I can harpoon her one more time and put it back here. Or do we? But that's still that that that's still so behind it. What about if I pull burn a brand? That's that five. still puts us behind. Okay, so I don't think we can hang, dude. He's he's hovering over them cards, man. He wants this round. We got one more. Right, you know what? I, I believe you. We'll pull another harpooner. We'll move Troll a little back. Okay, okay. This is um this is a public message to all the people out there. Don't do Sometimes this. Sometimes you just let it go. <laughs> you just gotta let it go, dude. <laughs> yeah, this is... So he's gonna start getting value out of that. Um so now we burn and we can get ahead. Right. I don't know if Burn is a legit option. We can we can also get ahead with Coral. Taking out this. Yeah. Let's do it. Coral. The only problem is I gotta be a trollolo. And the cool part is that those things are gonna start taking okay now. Okay, now I think he has to go two down, <laughs> at least one down. Lacerate? No. Oh. Well, I think we're we're good here, right? <laughs> I, I yeah, I don't think we can go any farther because he can Radovid for a ton. We have no way to overcome it with Radovid, yeah. and we have and nothing. He's our, our, one damage. Our Freya's dead. I think this is it. I think, honestly, for how messy it was, I'll take this. He might. No, he can't take the tie. No, he. Gonna... Yeah, 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 no, he can't. He's going he's gonna to take one damage. Just hopefully. And he already used his uh, Dijkstra. Too, Dijkstra. So if he doesn't draw. But, the... no, that's because he has Blue Drip. Really? He had that? That could have saved him a long time ago. Yeah, that's all right. That's. We, we we bet high and we and we we came out on top. We just got to get like a like a veteran or something here. God, we need everything. <laughs> I don't. Yeah, here we go. 
and uh, and ask me. Lacerate probably drop, huh? I think we drop the lacerate. And I think we bet everything on on that on what's it called. <gasps> that might be all right though in the last round with Ragnarug. We might need that just to keep up with them. He's going in, man. Shawnee, right off the rip. If he if he's Shawnee's right off the Okay, I think we're going all in. He's gonna go all in. Honestly, I think it's time to rock that rook, dude. You think so? Yeah. Because, like, dude, the way that this guy played, I think he's going all in. He needs his daily, Damn man. It. He got to use the restroom or something. He's like, man, I got to... I think you're right. <laughs> <laughs> my daily, so I'm like, I'm going to go in. Yeah, shoot. I, 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 I'm, I'm, I've done plays that I'm not very proud of, especially on my dailies. I um, I play. Oh God, well we can pull that we can to the move front, it. right? Yeah, we can move it. Uh, I don't play that. I'm not very proud of guys. Sometimes I play Syria at the beginning just so they can pass, and then I win the round, and I'm like, see ya. I done it twice. I've been guilty. It won't have no armor on it either, so which that's good. Yeah, that's really good. Gonna pass. Well, we get it in one, right? We get it with the veteran because he loses two. What? What are we gonna do with Adiko? Here's the thing: if we if we use the veteran right now, right? We uh don't have a decoy target, and we have to throw away our twelve, right? Right. So then I think we have to use decoy. Now, what do we rest? Do we we can rest the veteran. Yeah. I think we become better on deck now. Him being able to play Radovid last is going to be a thing. We need to draw Sigdrifa. No, we need to for him not to have Shani. Like he cannot have Shani. If he has Shani, dude, it's that's it, dude. I walk I walk towards the light right away. There's an axe, man. We don't have any way to ping with it. So we drop Ulderic Donner. We could steal... Oh, it's only bronze unit. Darn it. I was going to say we could steal. Oh, this is the card he drew from his thing. This is the card he drew f or he had in hand. So if, the, if he had this in hand, he had Shawnee the whole time. We can bait that we're going to have damage with <laughs> with the X-Men. Right. Maybe, like, yeah, uh, maybe that can get them to lock it early. Uh, no, to put it on, on Siege, remember? Because they play on Siege. Okay, okay. Lock it. Like, there you did. <laughs> he ain't gonna do it. I don't think he's gonna do it. He he's just too sick because of this point. You can, you can play around it. Well, at least we can lock that. That's good. But then he acts, man, right? Uh, he rather. What do we want to steal play. here? We want to steal the soldier. Man, I mean, everything is terrible here, dude. I think we just do a. We steal the elite. Yeah, I think we do the lead. The lead is fine. Because it's, it has to be Blue Dream. If it's Shani, we lose. If it's Blue Dream, it's going to be rough. Donar is not a veteran, unfortunately. He's going to ratto now, huh? And now the Axeman is not a... What? No, he keeps the tag. You still keep the tag. It'll go up one. No, it doesn't. No, no, I think yeah. it is. But, like, my question is why he didn't unlock his... I mean, he, I guess he figured out that... Oh! No! <laughs> no! Oh, my goodness. I, gonna... I'll tell you what. For somebody who uses those kind of cards, you know, at this point, I just tip my hat and go, like, sir... 
<laughs> you One got it. Point necromancy. You got it, dude. The necromancy. <laughs> dude, we played that game perfect. Absolutely perfect. He played like shit, and he still won. <laughs> Great game. I, I I tip my hat to that. Dude. It's just because that necromancy. He had that necromancy in his hand the whole time. I know, dude. I know. I thought it was Shandy, dude. I thought it was Shandy. Oh man, that's a that's a dandelion clip right there. We'll send that to him. Dude, huge shout out to him, man. I think that the guy who works in the dandelion show, he does fantastic job. I enjoy his videos a lot. Oh yeah, dude, they're he's been do, getting them better and better each week, man. I I, I send him in a you know an email every once in a while. I haven't had any good clips, but that one might be a good one there. Yeah, necromancy. Who? Nobody specs the necromancy, dude. No, I didn't. <laughs> mm -hmm. And then he even used it on his own trollolo. Like we had veterans. We only drew two veterans. Um. So we got Berna. Um, Harpooner, three, three. I don't think we need three Freyas though. No, there's a veteran. Do we keep the? Sometimes they stack up. No, okay, but here's the thing. Let's 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 be really aggressive right now. We're gonna like Ragnarok like round zero. All right, so two Harpooners, burn a brand, a battle maiden. I think this is pretty good. Do, do we I keep the last right? Yeah, I think we keep the last area because we're going to be really aggressive. We're going to Ragnarug, you know. We learned that our opponents don't pass. I know. Okay, check. Okay, so now we do um, better, I think. Yeah. We'll play it here. So he's reveal. So that last rate might come into play with uh, the golems. Yep. So we're going to play our Axeman here. Does it get us up, though? It does not. I mean, if we use Ragnarok, right? And we call it a day. I think we're going to go down one anyway, right? What if we burn a and save Ragnarok? Uh, I'm, I'm of the mind that we're going to go down one. I think we're gonna go down one, hands down. So just Ragnarok. Yeah. I mean, if he passes, it's not the end of the world. If he clears it. If he clears it, well, we. That's when I start panicking, dude. Okay, he passes. Okay, he makes me a liar. What is it? Um. Uh... Really? Wow, dude. We are running into some greedy fools today, man. Uh, <laughs> greedy fool! Yes, dude! Alright, so we can... Uh, we Axeman now, or do we Herald now? We I Axeman. think we Axeman. Like, I, I'm a, I'm, my mind is done, dude. Like, there is nothing... Nobody's gonna change this. I'm going one card down. Right. Okay, okay. And we could just use the last rate right here if we need to. That's kind of like a dead card anyways. Wow, he keeps going. See, Devil? I'm, I guess though, I got this dude. I guess though if he has Peter in hand, it does the longer round it doesn't really matter. We could play this all day and he can just reset it with Peter. Oh god, I prefer if he Peters now than at the end anyway. This is I I I had a, I got a video coming out or it came out yesterday and uh the, or no, the date, it'll be Tuesday. And, uh, Thing can just fight through uh, Ragnarug like it's nothing, man. Spies and stuff, it's just like... Alright, so we can... Okay. We can catch up now with the... Uh, we can do the, the six, six. Right? Yeah. So we're finally up. He's playing Crow's Eye. So we got Crow's Eye and, and Necromancy meta that, that we missed, apparently. <laughs> I've, I've been gone for a week. Yeah, but if he swears it, we could still res it. 
you know, that's... I think I would rest it right now because he's going to do a uh, Bicobaro for sure. Play it in the back, huh? Well, if he, if he casts Gross Eye, that's bad, right? Yeah, that's true. Where's he going to get his damage from? I think next turn. Uh, well, the only thing that I can see helping him is it has to be Peter. It has to be Pete. It has to be... Um, I don't know, Leo? Another crow's eye. Dude. He's up. We just last right now, or do we res our... Oh, we have no way to res it. Grab okay, it. so we went first. The, the, this will win us, but I don't think... We have to... Okay, let me see. What if we... Decoy? No. The... Okay, so the lacerate... We have the lacerate option. We have the herald option. I think there's a lacerate, but I don't know if we lacerate on the front. Actually, we can lacerate the front if anything. If we ever need like extra oomph uh, from there on, it's gonna be rough. Anyway, right? That's it. Twenty-two. Peter is Peter row locked. He's row locked the melee, isn't he? Dude, this is insane. Why is he playing? He was, he's still playing. What else? Ah, dude, what that's, else? Can that's he, fourteen, dude. What else? Can ah. he, and he's if losing. he uses Peter, let's see. He won't lose. I think he still has to play another one because he, he will get hit by four. So we I pass. think I think we pass, man. Okay. Four. Okay, so let's say he peters, right? And he peters at 14. It drops to And then he hits four. Yeah, we still have ahead. Yeah, because he's he's gonna drop down to the axeman will drop down to three. And he'll have Peter's five, that's nineteen, he's gonna lose four. So he's gonna yeah, he's gonna drop down to fourteen again. Got him. Nice dude, nice. And he wa he wasted I think he wasted his uh elite when he he might have the spy, you know. Uh did we just drop this harpooner? It's only one strength. I think we can throw the drop the harpooner if we draw a spy, that would be that's okay. Do we just pass here, huh? And so we I get think last we just save. pass. We get last save. We could decoy a, our Freya. He just can't have the weather clear. But if he had the the weather clear, he would have used it. You know what I mean on on the last round. I I, I would have think so. Dude. I I've seen I've seen people play necromancy. Okay, <laughs> I've seen it all, dude. <laughs> This is it, man. This oh, is ah. Oh. We get we get two, two uh, two golems. We get we're gonna have a shame golem in our hand, Manny. No, we because blacklist, right? I think they. Oh yeah, that's true. But still, that's a pretty shame golem, dude. That's good. Oh yes, yes. We still got one veteran in the deck. We got two, two damages here with Berna and thing. I think our okay. We have to... so he has cross eye. We gotta remember that. We so got... we have to only use two rows. We got a resin axeman like ASAP though for the medics. If he has two medics, we're in big trouble. Here comes one medic right here. Premium Roach. I love that premium dude. Yeah, it's a silly card. I thought it was funny that they said it was like just a joke at first, and then they just kept it in because everybody loved it. It's 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 like that, man. Like some sometimes you just gotta have a sense of humor. 
Please don't throw the tent. Nice, nice. You can keep. Ah! I think we throw the tent. Dude. We use it. We use it now. Because yeah. of the elite, huh? Yeah. So we can res an axeman, and granted, we're not going to get a lot of value. Now, does that uh, harpooner reset when we put it back in the deck like that? Or does it stay one no, damage? No, it stays one, as I remember. Cancerella. So he's got Menno. He's got to have Menno. Okay, so um, let's see. We res our axeman can... and put it siege? I think we can. We, I don't know because remember cross eyes, so that's why we are. Oh yeah. We now we're kind of messed up right now. Uh, play it melee, huh? Yeah, I think we play it melee. Or maybe, maybe we're gonna decoy that thing anyway, so we can just start like putting it all the way in the back. Like we don't care for uh, Cantarella. Right here. I, no, they're stuck on Siege, right? Siege is their stu uh, yeah. the stuck point. Yeah. Play it on Siege, then. Yeah, I think we'll Siege. Hopefully the Crow's Eye hits the Axeman, then. And then what do we decoy another Axeman? No, go... No, I think like right now uh, we do. Uh, what's her name? Um, no, no, no. Birna Brand on the back. Because we're going to decoy that uh, Cantarell, and we're gonna get that points back with the uh, ah. With the weather. I see. I see. And watch, we'll draw Odoric too. Don't have the weather clear. <laughs> Dude, if he has cross eye and play weather, I'm done. I'm done. I'm turning <laughs> one eight in three. Living. Three golems, three crow's eye. Where's he getting his fourth one from? Because you keep you keep hitting for more, right? Oh shit, he's putting more in the deck. That's Man. okay because we're gonna throw the we're gonna throw the cantarella back. We we'll throw the cantarella back so we start getting value. And we put it all the way in the left. All the way back left. Here. Yeah. Right. <clears throat> we, we don't want that. <laughs> I knew we were going to get older. Rick. <laughs> I knew it, man. I knew we were going to get older, Rick. I just knew it, man. I just... In that case... Oh, we have to get too many things going on at once. You know what, though? If he plays thing, we're screwed. We got two dead. Oh, no. Can we use no, no, no. prayers? No, they have to be soldiers or machines. But no, no, that's the thing. We can actually... This is why we gotta, gotta do weather right now. Like, after. <gasps> it's beer. That's oh, okay. I think we, we gotta bring a... Is, is, are all the Axemen on the back? Yeah, on, we'll, on the graveyard? Yeah, yeah right? Yeah, yeah right. we gotta play our uh our, our spy man. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh we got Sigdrifa. Or do we Sig play Drifa for sure? Yeah. We uh Sig we can get a, for sure. Yeah, we can get another axeman. Look at this. Holy cow. I'll tell you what though, Harold might be yes. MVP here right here. Oh my god, he got another one. It's okay, it's gonna be Harold and not so creepo. Let's go with another Axeman! We're gonna have two dead uh, maidens, right? Yep. Yeah, let's go with the Axeman, man. Unless we play, uh... Unless we play a veteran. But I don't think it's going to be worth too much uh, as value as an Axeman. I think we gotta go for the gold, man. Oh, don't have Peter. Don't have no, Peter. Don't have Lacerate. I, dude, I think that if he Peter rolls, like, it's still going to be rough. I think we got this level. He, please don't have Lacerate. Lacerate 
five crows high <laughs> mock male Vesemir, <laughs> what is going on dude i didn't play gwent yesterday did i miss like some patch or something like this is bananas oh he had the mana core so he's gonna That's okay he's gonna bring down this I don't know. This is uh, uh, the if the last one is Peter still we're okay. He's gonna buff it to seventeen. I'm okay. I'm okay with that. So we play a dead uh, haymate, right? No, and we play. We get Harold mm -hmm. going, right? Dude, I think that Harold's gonna be enough at the end. I think. Uh, yeah, I think. Uh, yeah, I think because it's gonna be. What's that last card? He had lacerate. Called it. Okay, so yeah, I'm not smart. Now, now we can. Hit. Now we can handle it, right? because he'll get extra tings as we go. Oh right? yeah. I think that the proper thing was to use negative and just delete the the X Men. Actually, he couldn't have deleted the X Men. Oh, so good. <laughs> there it oh, is, man. So good. There so it good. Is. We did it. Dude. <laughs> Oh man, I thought we were gonna get memed on twice, dude. <laughs> dude, I mean, granted, we're playing Axman, and that's, that, but that's like a standard Axman list. But it's like, dude, two well, that just goes to show, you know, that he we gave him like three passes round one. <laughs> yeah, and then we had, I knew we were gonna draw Ulrich the last round, man. I just, I knew it. I, I just, I. I seen it. I was uh, I was Arthesius for like two seconds there. I was like, I can see this <laughs> card. <laughs> but uh, hey, that's the list for today, guys. Um, uh, if you haven't seen it yet, uh, definitely check out the podcast uh, talk show that we got on Gwent City with me and Shu and Gwent the Town and Randy of Sintra. Uh, we're probably gonna switch up the guests, I guess. Um, Manny, you're probably gonna be on this week, huh? Uh, you know, if there is a space, sure, you know, I think that the people have enough of me, uh, <laughs> you know, but overall, I prefer if, you know, I want the people to get to know the team members. I, I, I want them to get to know how much effort people put into this game, you know, and overall, I'm like, as I say, I'm just the mean factor, you know, that's that's what I said at the thing. I said, uh, I'm just here for the, com five, dude. the, the comic relief, man. I'm like, and they're like, yo, you can make it any. I'm like, nah, man. <laughs> Uh, like, oh, yeah, sure, yeah. sure, no problem. <laughs> I'll see you then next next month. <laughs> right, but yeah, I just I I like adding a little bit of you know fun to it. You know, they they add the technical side to it. You know, and I just uh, I drop my little quirks here and there. So, but uh, yeah, definitely check it out, man. Uh, uh, it's over on a Gwent City. Uh, it's labeled as the uh, the Grand Master Plan. So uh, definitely check mm -hmm. it out. But uh, we will see you guys next time.